Hey guys, Andre here, and we're about to play Mario Kart 8 Deluxe Online. Okay, that's a bit of a lie. I already played it online. This is a pre-recorded video, which is why I'm skipping ahead through the menus here. But the reason I'm showing you this is because I wanted to show you that the online works when you're playing tethered to your phone. Because one of the big things about the Nintendo Switch, of course, is the fact that you can play it anywhere. But what do you do if you want to play Mario Kart 8 Deluxe Online and you're not near a Wi-Fi point? You're kind of screwed, right? Well, apparently not, because spoilers, it works perfect in this video. Um, so yeah, I actually tethered it to my phone, and my phone is connected via T-Mobile's LTE network, or 4G network, and I noticed no hiccups, or weird warping, or delays, or any kind of lag at all. Like, it seemed to work pretty flawlessly, and you're gonna see that in this video. Um, so I'm not gonna talk through this entire thing, but I wanted to, you know, provide some context for what you're about to see and why uh, this is different from any other battle mode video, as well as to provide some quick impressions of how well it worked. So yeah, I'm gonna shut up for a few minutes here and I'll rejoin you at the end of the video. Oh yeah, come on Andre, you can do it! You can do it Andre, hold on to that shine! Oh man, the suspense! Nine seconds left! Aw, oh, Matty! How dare you steal my shine! Alright, yeah, what's up guys, I'm back. <laughs> it's a little bit weird to cheer myself on in the third person, but whatever. We don't abide by the rules here at Game Explain, except we normally do, but... I break them when I want to, whatever. Um, so as you can see, I mean, Shine Thief is a chaotic mode. It is absolutely insane. I think we were playing with frantic items too, as I recall. Maybe not, I can't fully remember. I think the fact that a mode as frantic as this, with, you know, characters and items flying everywhere and the shine switching places, the fact that all this works as flawlessly as it does via a cell phone connection is commendable. Um, yeah, so there you have it. The match finished. I didn't win, unfortunately. <laughs> uh, and yeah, it worked really well in my experience. I played, actually, I played, um for half an hour on my mobile phone, and I had no issues at all throughout the entire time. Now, in case you're wondering how much data it used for that period, uh, it was about 130 megabytes according to my phone. Um, so yeah, you're gonna wanna keep that in mind before you start tethering yourself, because it could burn through your data plan pretty quickly um, if, you do that, if you do that often. But yeah, there you have it, guys. Um, there are my quick impressions of what it's like to play Mario Kart 8 Deluxe Online. Rest assured, it works. 
Uh, presum presumably as long as you have a good cell phone connection. And I had a rock solid one. If you're out in the boonies, there's a good chance it may not work nearly as well, if, if at all. <laughs> um, and that may not be fair to everyone else you're playing with as well, so keep that in mind. But if you're somewhere where you have a strong signal, give it a shot. Alright guys, thanks for watching. Of course, stay tuned to Game Explain for lots more on Mario Kart 8 Deluxe and other things gaming as well. Catch you later. Bye.